Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Resonance of Fate. The enemies here in Patertopolis have changed, and they're good for farming, actually, but just to save save time, I'm going to speed through it, and if I decide to farm, farm some of this, I'll do that off-screen. I just want to keep my basils up, and I'll be satisfied. Can't even do that, I guess. This, here in the second room, there's this mad Goliath, and he drops a pretty rare item. I'm not, I don't know what it's used for, honestly, but I know it's rare. And he poisons, so that's fun. Sprocket Juggernaut, Sprocket Juggernaut, Mad Yeti. Targeting me, yes. Go. You want me on offense or defense? What do we got? This one's Rocket Juggernauts. Missile Plow. Missile Plow also has uh, good items. But again, just for the, the sake of expediting the video. run through. Some more poison gremlins. Oh, must not be any enemies in this one. I got my basils back. I don't see any treasure chests either. There's a treasure chest. Just the one? Yep. And what do we got? What's the gift? It's a bundle of love. Yeah. Using escape hex. Let's get out of here. Now we, uh, we gotta run back up to Pater's Manor and talk to the maid again. I'll uh, just meet you up there. Here's your bubble Hello. Up. Yeah. A t shirt. We'll check it out. Victory Pater. Okay. Now I picked up an energy station for this to put on this floor because when we got access to the purple hexes, I was able to clear out the last two hexes for this floor, which means I can bypass the core lift and just return to base. So I'll recommend, I'd recommend that to, to anyone. I'd also, I mentioned before, at some point, place one on level 11 and clear all the, or level 10, one or the other, and clear all the hexes off so you can bypass the third core lift as well. What's that? Flameproof suit and a multi aid RS for getting must be 600 hunter points. And it's daytime. I think we have a doll. Yeah, witchy mama. We can go turn in. And on the way, I'm going to double check the message board. Make sure we don't have any other side quests for this chapter. I don't think there are. Nope, oh, all done. What 
Fuck now. Yeah, I'll give it up. XP trainer. What now? Huh. I guess that's one way to think of it. Now I'm actually going to put that on. I think it lowers item drop rate, increases experience earned. Hmm. Maybe not. I like items. Was there a shiny there? Or is I seeing things? Seeing things. At some point I'm going to have to load up my original playthrough and check out my weapons there and see how I have them, cu them customized. I need to probably do some work on these. There's a pretty big difference between my best gun, that upgraded machine gun, and uh, the rest of them. Yeah, I'm going to save just in case. Why not? I'm going to save again, because this will be at the beginning of chapter 11. Perfect is your judgment. Does it never falter? Does it never err? I know it's never had room for emotion. I don't let feelings cloud my judgment either. How could I? Now. I think it's time to find a place where those feelings belong. What are you getting at? Farewell, my lord. I came to say goodbye. Not as a cardinal, but as a friend. What do you say? Just like old times? Well aged. A good bottle. You should know, you gave it to me. As a cardinal. I let myself get too caught up in the little things. Don't be too hard on yourself. What could be smaller than the troubles between two people? You're right. All we've ever done is choose between good and evil as it suits us. That's why there's nothing I want more than to kill him! <laughs> These aren't ruins. God walks among us here. If you think God bothers to meddle in human lives... ...he'll never find a place for those feelings. Which is why I've folded my wings. I want to fall. Hmm. That's depressing.
he's gone. Rowan, is this really what you wanted? How can I turn him from the same path that I've chosen for myself? Isn't this a surprise? What's it been? One? Two years? <laughs> what brings you by? You're on business? I'm looking for a boy named Zephyr. It's my understanding you've taken him in. Oh, I don't think he's around, actually. Yeah, I remember him saying something about uh, going on a trip. <laughs> so, what did you need? Uh, be sure to give him the message. I never stopped investigating the incident. There are some loose ends that need tying. That's in the past. Your god passed his judgment on that a long time ago. God. <laughs> I think I may have come around to your way of thinking on that. I haven't come to you as a cardinal in service of his god. I'm here. As an ordinary man. Well then, I don't see much reason to let you in. So you judge him worthy of life? Kill me now then while you have the chance. The next time we meet, we'll be enemies. Or maybe we can come to an arrangement. If it's money you want, name your price! I don't judge him. Whoa, he actually turned down money? Zephyr! Do you still have the scriptures, boy? We have much to discuss, you and I. There's a bridge nearby. Meet me there and we'll talk, just the two of us. How blind can he be? Like eight feet above you. I can't find Zephyr! <laughs> so, he went. Well, aren't we going to go help him? He made his bed. Let him lie in it. Are you serious? Now, let's see. Pretty sure I'm gonna want... One of each. Then let's go with Hawkeye, Elemental Protector. That'll work. Give me twenty percent defense and all. Areas. It says it says elements. It says twenty percent defense to all elements, but it also gives twenty percent physical defense. I don't know if this game considers that an element, but yeah, whatever. I'm glad you came, Zephyr. Do you remember me? I was the witness assigned to your execution. My name is Lagerfeld. I was once Cardinal of the Tenth Diocese of Chandelier. I've come to bury the grief of the bereaved and the dead. And if I'm lucky, my own. Mass had finally started when, from the far end of the hall, 
A muffled scream rang out. It had begun. Don't. We arrived twenty minutes later. When I saw the carnage that awaited us, it was beyond all imagining. Tell me! What did the girl slumped in the corner of the alcove say before she died? The explosion wreaked such damage, many of the corpses were beyond recognition. How should we mark their graves? The mother of a boy whose body was riddled with bullets said she could forgive you. Tell me, why did you live while they died? Is your life worth more than theirs? It sickens me to even look at you. Your life is a blasphemy. Your very existence shakes the foundation of faith. Only your death will satisfy me. It's pretty intense. Now, I don't remember off the top of my head right now. But no, there's a trick to this guy. He teleports or something. I guess we'll find out. Just a pretense to tell the truth. What truth, Zephyr? You may have been misguided, but you were never alone. Yeah. Holy cow. Mm, not good. Well, that was quick. Okay, let's try without the hero run. Get him to teleport. Now hero, actually. Nope. You may have been misguided, but you were never alone. Let's see. He's gonna teleport. When he comes back in, see if he can do some damage. Your 
spirits there we go again to the now we're about to learn something very interesting Zephyr. thanks okay I when he's charging this. get behind him kill you. this battle is just a pretense to tell you the truth what truth Zephyr? you may have been misguided I don't know why that works, but just just run past him so that you're behind him and shoot. And then for some reason, oh well, he dodged at that time. And then if you're if you're having trouble with the damage you're taking, you can run past him. Like say if he was over in that direction somewhere, run past him and aim to stop on the red switch that'll bring the the barrier up and that'll help soak up some of his damage. But there's that. Do you still have the scriptures she gave you? Did you ever open it to the last page? You should find a picture like this one just inside the back cover. This is my... my sister. There were a lot of orphans in that school. If you hadn't been so stubborn, I could have told you the truth. Their blood is on your hands! Hmm. Wonder who that is. Yep. Leanne. Why? You idiot! You wanted to die, didn't you? <laughs> Wouldn't it be better that way? Uh, I should be dead. You think that can make up for what you did? Not even close! <laughs> if you're going to die, at least die with courage. Why am I... Why am I even alive? If you hadn't been there, I'd be dead. Isn't that enough? Hmm. I want... Yeah? I want Leanne to be happy. Fair enough. Then... I can die. Ah! Hmm. Hmm. 
<laughs> she must have heard him. I know the Cardinals do not follow me unconditionally. It is because you have placed your trust in me that others lend me their support. I hadn't realized. That's just as well. It's enough that you go on being yourself. I don't know what I'd do without you. Anturian was a trusted ally. A true friend. With a shared vision for our future. Now, he grows more distant with each passing day. Lagerfeld is gone, too. The Cardinals have been scattered on the wind. He will never be as it was in Frida's day again. You're even less pleasant today than you usually are. Even that eccentric maniac Guerrilliano pledged his loyalty to Frida. You loved her, didn't you? I did. Lagerfeld and Turian, that freak Guerrilliano. She... She brought them all into her dream. Her dream of a world of everlasting happiness. I was so close to being utterly alone. I don't know what I would have done without you. Hmm. And no. We have all the side quests to do, but that's going to have to wait for another time. Thanks for watching.